For sisters who don't remember the number of fasts they missed due to their monthly cycles, what should they do, even if it exceeds 300 days? They fast as much as they can. And you know, what about... They, I think I mean, you can't, you can't say that, you know, you can just cut it off now, just forget it, don't worry about it. Because if you miss the fast, you know, you have been delinquent in not making them up. Because uh, fasting is just one month in the year, you've got 11 other months. And if you miss uh, for, for because of uh, menstruation, you're talking about one week. The average is like one week. So you have 11 months to make up seven days of fasting. And you have been negligent and just left them till they reach the number of 300. Um, I don't even know whether that's, that number is possible. You know? I mean, how many years you'd have to go to, to reach 300. Uh, but... Uh, you know, you are responsible before Allah. That remains with you. You die with it as a responsibility on your back, you know, as a debt to Allah which you have not fulfilled. So, Dr. Bilal, I also wonder how it could exceed 300. However, would one just, like, for example, if they know they got their menstruation at the age of 15, and for some reason or another they're 30 years old and they realize for the last 15 years they never made up their days of menstruation, their average cycle is seven days, wouldn't they just take seven and multiply that by 15 and then try to, as quickly as they can, make up those days? Or would they also yeah. need to pay a fidia along with that? Pay fidia and also make up the days because of the lengthy duration no, no. of the days? No, 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 no. They miss the days, okay. they have to make up the days. There's no fidia uh, required of them. So they would just try to calculate it to the best of their yeah. ability and yeah. make it up over, over time. 